In a new letter to parents, Principal Kathy Pariello of Lackey High School in Indian Head said that before the fight that happened here Friday, there had been no complaints about hazing and bullying on the football team. We do not have any information that would indicate there is a hazing issue among any students at our school, the principal's letter to the school community said. The hazing allegation was made by the family of 14-year-old player Zayden Flemings, who was badly injured in a fight with a teammate Friday at the school. Zayden and his family claim he has endured months of bullying and harassment on the team regarding his weight and appearance resulting in confrontations. Here's grandmother Marlene Flemings McCann. We didn't send him to school to go get hurt. We sent him to go play a sport at a game he loves and to learn. And Charles County did nothing for him. A new medical report says Zayden has two broken bones around his eye that require a facial trauma specialist and an ophthalmologist. Zayden's mother said he's still seeing double five days after the fight. Principal Pariello's letter also confirms a law enforcement investigation is underway. Legal experts are raising questions. Proper supervision of these children uh, could have prevented uh, this incident from happening. Maryland attorney Billy Murphy says school authorities are obligated by law to call for immediate medical help and to report to law enforcement just as quickly. But in an email, the school system told WUSA 9, we do not have a record of phone calls from either the coaches or the school for either medical aid or law enforcement. Instead, Zayden's mother said coaches escorted the injured boy to her car. School officials say that's because she asked them to after she, quote, allegedly made verbal comments to school staff that she was planning to come inside the building to confront the other involved students. Meanwhile, a text message to players from a number associated with one assistant coach said, delete now. Zayden's mother believes it was an attempt to get players to delete photos and videos of the fight and obstruct the investigation. The coach has not responded to WUSA 9's repeated attempts to get a response. School authorities say they don't know anything about the text and they're not commenting. Scott Broom, WUSA 9. Zayden has not returned to school because his injury prevents him from reading. This is what his mother says. The Lackey High School football team takes to the field in regional playoffs Friday night. The school system will not say if any disciplinary actions have been taken against any students or staff.